Okay, this goes along with exercise 21 with dealing with human reflexes. We're going to demonstrate a few of the reflexes here. First one I'm going to demonstrate is the patella reflex, uh, often referred to as the knee jerk reflex. I've marked on the knee here where we want to hit. Now normally you would be using your reflex hammer, but since we are doing this at home, we're using what is available. So watch the subject as we hit on the mark there. Did you notice that the leg did jerk? Now, another reflex that we can look at is the plantar uh, reflex. So for here, you're gonna hold the foot up like this. And you can use the reflex hammer, or you can actually use your finger. Watch what happens when I stroke the bottom of the foot. Notice how the toes scrunch up. That's a normal reflex for an adult. With a newborn, the toes would actually spread out, and that would be considered a normal uh, response for a newborn, the spreading out. That's known as a Babinski sign. In an adult, that would not be normal. That would be indicative of some type of nerve damage that has occurred there. Okay, for the pupillary reflex, what we're going to do is notice how the size of the pupil, the black area of the eye, is going to change depending on how much light is shining in on it. So notice the eyes right now, and look at both of them, the size of the pupil. And now what I'm going to do is shine the light. So watch what happens to the size. You see how the size gets much smaller when you shine the light in? And actually both of them get smaller, even though you're trying to shine the light in one eye. Both will react and get smaller. The more light coming in, the smaller the pupil is going to be.